Today I'm doing face makeup. I've updated my makeup routine. I always start with a random ass primer. This is the one that I've been using recently. It's really dirty. <laughs> Crust! Mm -hmm. After using this foundation, I feel like I always use this in the winter. Also really dirty. It's literally the perfect coverage and it's not too thick, but it's also not too fucking. Also, ColourPop is just so good and cheap, like, compared to the other makeup brands. <laughs> oh, you just went in my eye. <laughs> Never want to waste your money again. This. The mini Tarte Contour. The fuck? It's so much better than all the other brands and you actually get a good deal for it. Contour placement is, like, one of the most important parts of my makeup routine. So take note. This is where your contour should be. Let's emphasize the nose the most because that's the most important. I'm getting my wisdom teeth out tomorrow and I'm so scared. I literally have the biggest fear of the dentist. The reason I have a fear that my jaw is going to get stuck open. I use the Kosas concealer. Anyone that said that it makes you break out, you're lying. This is the concealer placement. You do it under the eyes a little bit and then on the outsides. And then you do a line horizontal on the nose and one vertical at the top. One of the most important parts of concealer is take it after you blend your under eyes and put it against your nose to snatch it. Laura Mercier powder, always. I need to bronze. And this Nars Laguna bronzer is the only bronzer you should ever get in your life. Every other bronzer is trash. I'm mewing. Here's the two blushes I use. One of them isn't a blush. It's actually a red MAC lipstick. And this is the Patrick Ta in shade She's Blushy. This one is really good because it blends your bronzer in because it's kind of brown. You take the red lipstick on the beauty blender. Get it on there. Thinks it's going to be too much, but it's not. It's just a light, nice, warm glow. Now I use this Tarte highlighter only for the nose. I put the highlighter exactly where I put the concealer to highlight the nose. And I use this little It Cosmetics highlighter stick for the inner corners. Ouch! <laughs> now we use Saint Tropez tanner and a stippling brush for freckles. This is the only way to do freckles. They're just cute and light and then you bounce it away with a beauty blender. We're gonna do our eyebrows, but I'm gonna do it off camera because everyone does their eyebrows different. It's a got to be glue eyebrow gel and then I use the Anastasia pencil. I use black eyeshadow to do a tiny bit of a wing. I just like the smallest wing ever and then we're gonna buff it out gonna buff it out a little bit then i use these eyelashes and cut it in half she's doing her own mascara because i can't do it on other people she did her mascara in a tiny bit of white liner i put these little half lashes just on the outer corners love how half lashes look like it makes your eye shape just look really cute for the lips i'm using kylie's lip liner in the shade kylie you line them and i only overline the top lip just right at the tip i just like pat it on top a little bit if you have blue eyes look how much the red like on top makes her eyes pop a step we're using Kylie's gloss in the shade Clear. You can just put it on top. Here's the final makeup. Now you guys can know how to wear 10,000 pounds of makeup too. Nice, that's it. Bye.